You can't listen to the game while we're recording. Okay, I gotta take a shot. Okay. Yeah. You gotta hold it up to the camera. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, it is. I got it recording. Yeah, yeah. Okay, babe. You ready? Thank you for tuning in to another episode of Scenes by Joy with Joyce. And today, I have a special guest. This is Bill, you guys. What's up? So, we have made it to day 23 of Vlogmas. And for today's Vlogmas special, I wanted to do a, he want to call it a Friends with Benefits Challenge. I want to call it the exes quiz, kind of like a play on the couples quiz because we're exes. You know but you want to do friends with benefits? Tomato, tomato. Go ahead. Whatever. So what we gonna do? We gonna ask each other five questions each today, and if we don't want to answer the question, we gotta take a shot. Which we already know, took a shot to kind of get this thing going, but I'm gonna answer everything, so I'm probably not gonna take a shot. If I do take a shot, it'll just be for fun. So. Let's go ahead and get to it. Why are you not talking to the people? What's up, everybody? I'm Bivens Carraway. Nice to meet you. <laughs> uh, shout out to everybody. My uh, my kinfolk. You know what I'm saying? My baby girl. Uh, uh, yeah, that's it right there. I'm going to leave it at that. Okay, yes. Anyways, so. Niggas, we can't, can't get a whole little five minutes still. All right, so. You pouring a shot? Yeah. So you're not going to answer the. Yeah, I just need another shot. Okay, whatever. Take the middle shot. Fuck it. He's just gonna take another shot. All right, bitch. Oh yeah, I was supposed to give an intro about you. I was about to tell them you the reason why I'm F R E E fuck nigga freak. <laughs> that means I ain't got a. <laughs> okay, so my first question for the friends with benefits exes quiz is: How many times did you cheat on me when we were together? I ain't and sure. wait, and that includes calling, texting, sliding in somebody DMs. Shit, you ain't supposed to be doing. I ain't gonna lie, I ain't cheat on you. Like if I was just like not fuck with y'all, I wouldn't fuck with you. I ain't cheat on you though. So you never. I ain't cheat on you. If anything, I would just if I was just out the shit and I was just moving around. Like I was like, nah, I'm good. But I ain't never cheat on you though. Never. I ain't never cheat. I swear. If anything, I was just like. A fuck niggas, but okay, so he said he never cheated. I guess it's like that. I mean, I never cheated on you either. I told you I used to be a habitual cheater, but I never cheated on you. Yeah, so this is an exit quiz or whatever, however. But you know, I'm gonna keep it. I gotta be variety. I keep a little variety. But we, but we're still friends though. So yeah, she all right. Uh, so if <laughs> you could move anywhere in the country, which state and why? If I can move anywhere in the country. Anywhere in the country right now, drop everything you're doing and move somewhere in the country. Just, you know what I'm saying? Why? What state and why? In the country, though. I'll move to Los Angeles, California. Well, why? Because it's just my happy place. Like, every time I've ever been out in LA, like, I just like the vibe. I just like the feel. I don't know. I always call it my happy place. Cost wise, I'll probably Atlanta, Georgia. But most definitely, if I didn't have to worry about expenses or anything like that, I would move to Los Angeles. Mm, for sure, for sure. See, I thought you were going to ask me something. All my questions uh, are just, like... Yeah, 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 yeah. But I ain't, you know, just go ahead. Okay. Uh, Where do I rank in your relationship experiences? Out of all the 50 million girls you have dated, where do I rank? Morgan asked me that shit the other day. Who asked you this shit? Though? Marcus asked me this shit. Though. Say, I'm what asked you this shit? Though? Yeah. In reference to me, it's just overall. Yeah. He was just asking me my top five. Your top five? Okay, so am I in your top five? Yeah, you in the top five for sure. So where do I rank? We ain't gonna rank none of them, but you in the top five for sure. You know what I'm saying? You in the top five. You in the top. You up there. But you ain't gonna tell me what number? Nah, I mean, because you know it all varies and shit. It's a range. But top five. You top five? Mm. Damn. Top I, I mean, you could at least tell me if I was like one, two, three. Yeah, but top five, top three. Okay. I'll take that. Top three, top two. I'll take that. Top two. 
I'm the best bitch this nigga done ain't gonna Alright, so then you, the relationship shit, I go ahead then. If you in a relationship with somebody, things go south, have you ever spent the block? And if so, <laughs> why? So why did you just ask me? Why did you ask it hypothetically? No, when no, basically no. you asking this in regards no, to yourself. No, no, I'm just yes, asking Yes, you are asking it in regards to yourself. Bro, it's supposed you, to be personal questions. Are you, so, are you answering the question? So you said if I ever spent the block on you, which I no, have to spend the block on you before. Like, like, why? Like, why why have I ever spent the block on you before? Okay, why? Yeah, Cause you know yeah. I don't spend the block. And you know that. So you talk about yourself. Alright, well I just I'm just I'm just asking. You know what I'm saying? So why have I spent the block? Yeah, oh, okay. Okay, I we are in Dallas, you guys. I live in Dallas. I've been living in Dallas. And I have never really dated a Dallas native dude. I really don't vibe with Dallas men. They're really just not my cup of tea overall. And then when I then when I met this loser or whatever, and we did start talking, he's from East Texas. So I guess Longview. Whatever. Longview, Texas. Longview five, had six, Longview has the grimiest men ever. Don't ever date a man from Longview ever they the worst of the worst something was wrong with the water down there but the reason why i spent the block on this clown is because he just reminded me he just reminded me a piece of home like i'm not from dallas i'm from east texas and i mean he's from east texas and although he ain't got no fucking sense he's just i don't know he's just my type of crazy like something i recognize from home so and I don't spend the block on men, period. I have never spent the block, but somehow I end up spending the block on him for whatever reason, but don't ever date a man from Longview, Texas. I'm telling you now, ladies. I'm telling you right now. So is it my turn? Uh, no, it's my turn, actually. No, you just asked me to spend the block question, so it's my turn. Oh, yeah, it's your turn, right? Okay, so it's my turn. What was one thing you wish we could have experienced when we were together? One thing that we never experienced together that you wish we could have experienced. Don't fucking say. <laughs> well, I mean. Besides that. Nah, like, all right, besides <laughs> that, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, we would have took a trip or, you know what I'm saying? Like a, like a big, like a, you know what I'm saying? We flew somewhere or some other shit like that. You, you know, know you treat so, me like a. But, you know. The first answer, I'm gonna I'm just chill. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Cause, Cause I'm not doing it. I gotta be deserving, I guess. I don't know. But it's we'll never, what he's talking about is never gonna happen. I got so. to be deserving. I don't know what you gotta do. And to I was just. Some he, shit. Want a, he wanted a threesome yeah, from me. I'm gonna just say. Right, okay, I'm just gonna say he wanted a threesome from me. I'm not giving him a threesome. And even when I say little bullshit like, oh, you gotta be deserving, da, 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 I'm lying. I'm lying. I'm not having a threesome with you. Okay. Period. Right, so I just gotta take it. So, yeah, take it. So you wish we would have just took a trip together. <laughs> like a bitch. You know, went somewhere, just did something slight, you know what I'm saying? Because you know, I don't do too much, I just be chilling and shit, so. Okay, yeah, I think that would have been dope. I think that would have been really dope. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go back out top of that the relationship shit, though, because you know, it's you know, a little bit shit in this world besides that. Yeah, so look. Okay, that's the whole purpose of the All right, all right, all right, all right. So look. Look, look, look. Give me a reason why I should throw, throw this bottle in your face. So. Right Cause you don't wanna do that. <laughs> uh, so look, so Brittany Griner just got out. Okay. You know what I'm saying, Brittany Griner. You know what I'm saying, she got out or whatever. But they traded her for uh, 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 a, a dude. Some other Russian man who was making like all these crazy with you. And yeah, people. and conspiring to kill people out in the U.S. Do you think it was a fair trade? He known as a merchant of death. Was it a fair trade or like they hold her anyway? Okay. So the thing is. Okay, when that topic had came across, the reason people look at it as it's not a fresh trade because he had killed all these people. And what she did was, you know, minor to us Americans. So people didn't think it was a fair trade. But the thing is, the man was going to get out of jail anyway. He was going to get released anyway. He wasn't in there for life. So it just kind of expedited his release date. But he was going to get out anyway. So I... 
all, you don't ask me this whack ass question that literally has nothing to do with the topic and you brushing your hair on camera and you looking at yourself on camera. Bro, the people want to know a lot, a lot of it. Okay, guys, I'm going to tell y'all, this is where the conflict of interest takes part. Two Leos can just not be together. And then there is a difference between a July Leo and an August Leo. As you can see, us August Leos have sense. And July Leos don't have no fucking sense because you don't ask me a question about Brittany Grinder. This supposed to be an exes quiz, friends from benefits challenge, or what the hell you trying to say. And you ask me about this Russian man and Brittany Grinder, and when I'm trying to give you a educated answer, you doing that bullshit. Man, I'm featured on here. I'm really trying to see how much I'm getting paid for this. I ain't getting paid for this. I'm just trying to see though. Anyway, anyway, did I answer your question? No, oh, you did. Okay, my question that's on topic uh, to what we're supposed to be discussing. Uh, okay, what's the craziest thing you ever thought about doing to me during an argument? Mm, and I really don't even argue, guys. Nah, we don't, I don't even argue anyway. I really just don't be on this shit. Bullshit. Like I mean, yeah, but like the craziest thing though, know, like. Now that shit, that one night you had a hair of your head, you was uh, doing all that motherfucking yelling and Okay, I didn't tell you to, re I didn't tell you to replay a situation. Okay, but I'm just saying, though. No. What was the crazy thing? How did you want to retaliate? Because this, this the only time I'm thinking about. You was doing all that extra ass shit, and I was just like, man, I really a muffy a motherfucking ass. But, you know what I'm saying? I was just... But why was I doing all that extra shit? Because let's not get on his <laughs> dog ass. Bro. And my reaction was slight. It really wasn't. Slight. Though, but Any other bitch would have killed you for this. Lies. Cap. What's your next question? Um. Look at your notes. Nah, 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 nah. I think I want to freestyle this bitch <laughs> right here. I think I want to do this. I'm just gonna have me a little drink. I ain't said no nothing, but I'm a champagne drink. I don't do wine, but. Ask the question. So, when we was in a relationship, did you ever cheat on me? Bill, I literally answered that when you, when I had asked you the question, I told you that I used to be a habitual cheater. You said you never cheated on me. I, I, like, I never cheated on you. Whatever about it, I asked you. I, it really was yes or no. I've never cheated on you. Alright, that's all I was. Out of all the she men I've dated me, so and cheated I, on, I, you. I never cheated on you. And to this day, you should have been the one that I cheated on the heavy. <laughs> I'll take that. That's fair. Very fair. That's fair. But no, I have never. Nah, no, never. I never. Never. Seen a nigga at the store, he shot never. and shot. You, oh, ooh, ooh. Never. None of that. Never. No, when I was with you, I was all in with you. I never. Like that, like a crib. Like a blood. Oh, no, I never cheated on your big headed ass. Should have, but did it. I mean, what how many questions that is? What is? Yeah, I'm on my last question. Okay. You know, you're trying to watch the game, parlays and shit. And I need, need $15 worth of parlays. And man. I ain't got shit on it. Okay. If you could have changed anything about our breakup, what would it be? I mean, you know, she go how it go, time and go how it go. I mean, you know, just on some real shit, like, you know, my communication just ain't the best, but, I mean, shit, you know, niggas growing up and shit like that, so. Um, the question was, what could you have changed? Come on, well, we're back and ask you. So, you wish you could have been better at communication? Yeah, I mean, you know. I ain't the best with this. I am, but I ain't the best with this. Shit. Sometimes I just don't be honest. So I just, you know what I'm saying? But shit, though, you know what I'm Cause saying? Cause you don't like to answer to nobody. That's, yeah, that's your thing. You don't like to explain yourself for answer to nobody. Yeah, I don't. And like, you gotta answer to somebody. You don't really know. Yeah, you do. All right. No, okay, so. Hey, what's my final question? The final question is not relationship related, but. <laughs> what is it? It's a good question, though. Okay. So, boom, you've been blogging for 20 some days now. Okay. You know what I'm saying? You're doing your thing, you're staying consistent, relentless with the shit or whatever. You know what I'm saying? So, mm, ideally, from like two or three years, five years from now, how many views would you want to have on your video? 
just say five years from now. How many subscribers, how many views since you know you into your vlog and shit? Like five years from now? Yeah, five years from now. Just say like five years from now, like shit go good in the bitch or whatever. And you just, you know what I'm saying? I would, like five years from now, I would expect or would like to have in between 500K, almost hitting that million threshold. Type shit. It's well, possible. Like, how, well, it okay, well, what about the views on the shit? Like, but it's like once you hit that many subscribers, I mean the views they just they gonna be at a certain amount. I don't know, but I know they're gonna be at a good amount. I know that my videos will be monetized and I can actually use YouTube as a reliable source of income. So if I feel like if I hit in it 500k close to a mil range, then I'm good. At that point, it's just dropping videos because the following base is already there. So. Well, we have asked our five questions, which I mean, that last question it was very good, it was very thoughtful. No, but y'all no, questions no. was fucking whack. I mean, hey, hey I'm featured and I'm gonna like, be looking for how, my back end. How was I'm my, gonna be looking for my back end. How is my title supposed to be the essence quiz? But you was like, no, we should do friends with benefits challenge, and you didn't even ask anything in relation to this. I did, I had about two, I had about two you questions, had like two, two. two out of five, yeah, because I don't want to just be, you know what I'm saying, woo woo. I mean, what? I just thought those were some kind of relevant controversial topics, maybe. I had another question for you too, but it wasn't oh, it wasn't related it wasn't related to that shit. It was just like on some on some who you fuck with. This rapper or that rapper, why why? You feel me? Just on some shit like on some regular edges talking about. Okay, well we could have did that. Well, nah, we could have did that for another right, video. Baby, baby, hold on, hold on. Like we could have did that, but that wasn't the theme of this video. Oh y'all have a Merry Christmas. <laughs> It was nice to see y'all, and I might see y'all sometime soon. I'm gonna share this shit. Uh, I'm gonna put my page on there, um, and y'all fuck with me on there too. And oh, and my mom finna have a page too, so y'all gonna have to follow her too. Shout out to you. Merry Christmas, everybody, and Happy New Year. <laughs> Merry Christmas, and as always, like, comment, and subscribe, you guys. Bye.